A lot of people also ask me, how did I think of the name Boss Tunage and where did it come from? Well, obviously, I, by that time, I was descendants mad. So it was a really bad pun on the word Boston, which was the local town with, where, to where I lived, where I went to gigs. So Boston Edge, Tune Edge, yeah, really bad. Um, but also, it actually, I, I can honestly say that um, Wolfie, who was the original bassist in The Stupids, Wolfie Retard, he used to do um, a couple of fanzines, Smashed Hits, and then one called Groovy Crush Vibe was the one he was doing at the time when I was setting the label up and he used to call his review section Boss Tunage uh, and he did in his fanzine he did after that called Real Overdose so that is where I nicked the name from. Another thing that also used to confuse people is um, my actual name because obviously my name is Aston Stevens but and this is where it got confusing I was still living with my parents and my parents had actually built the house where we lived and the house was called Aston Furs so I did used to get checks made payable to the house, which then involved an, a letter back to people to say, here's your check back. I've kept your thing. Please, will you make it out for this name instead because you've actually made it out to my house name. So yeah, that, that got a bit confusing. And I do remember that when the Wanton Thought 7-inch came out in January 1991, uh, a guy called Giles Platt called me from BBC Radio Lincolnshire and he wanted to, I'd sent, I think I'd sent them a seven inch. Um, and because it was sort of like, it was a, a newsworthy story, um, having a uh, label based in rural Lincolnshire, um, he interviewed me over the phone. Now, unfortunately, when I did that interview, I actually only talked to him as, and called myself Aston. So when it came to um, be, um, I think it was on a Sunday afternoon, and Re Vehicle Derek actually recorded a session for this exact same, uh, program I think it was called Garage Band and it was like for the local music scene and they'd done a session about a year and a half earlier or so and um, when it when it aired he he announced me as Aston Furs from Boss Tonnage Records and I just 